Hello, my name is Keshwani. That's K E S H W A N R. Keshwani. We are here because we want to prepare for the GRE. Starting from today, you and I will work together and we'll solve all the math problems that we'll find in this book right here. The official guide to the revised GRE, the second edition. Make sure it is the second edition that you, that you have and not the first one. If you do not own this book already, purchase one immediately. You're going to need it. Let's begin our work, shall we? Let's begin our journey. Let's turn to page number 100 and 111. On page 111, the very first problem that we see there, they are asking us to compare the least, the least prime number greater than 24. Because it is a prime number, by prime number, by definition, have to be at least uh, have to be uh, odd number. Because if it were even, it would have been divisible by two. The only exception is two. Two is the only even number that is a prime number. All the other prime numbers have to be odd numbers. So let's make a list of all the odd numbers until we hit upon the first prime number. 25. Well, 25 is not a prime number. It's divisible by five. 27. 27 is divisible by three. It's not a prime number. 29 is our prime number. 29 is the least is the least prime number that is greater than 24. Let's look at the first column. In the first column, in the second column, I meant. In the second column, it says the greatest prime number less than 28. There is no point wasting our time trying to figure this out because it's a it's it's, it's, it's a moot point by now because of, because of the fact that we already found that the answer that the quantity in column A is 29. Whatever this happens to be, the greatest prime number, whatever that happens to be, by definition, has to be less than 28. Something less than 28, we don't care what that is, whatever the hell it is, something less than 28 has got to be, 29 has got to be something, huh, got to be more than that. And that's all there is. The answer is A. The answer is A. Let's look at, uh, let's look at next problems. Problem number two. Problem number two that you see there next, problem number three and problem number four are the exact same problem, they are the exact same problem, exact same problem that appeared in this first edition. And I have solved all the math problem that you will find is first edition. There are over, there are 200 videos. There are not over, but there are exactly 200 videos you're going to find on my channels, uh, on my channel that that cover all the math problems in this book. There's about 48 hours worth of instructions. If you're interested, they are there. And if I come across any problem which is the same exact problem that appears in the second edition, I'm not going to resolve it. It's already been done. All I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you which day, which video to watch. And if you're interested, you can watch the solution. For example, if you're interested in, sol in, in, in watching the solution to problem number 2, 3, and 4, problem 2 and 3, just type in revised, just type in revised GRE, revised GRE math. This is a tag, revised GRE math, and just type in day 1. And you will see the solution to problem number 2 and 3. Problem number 4 was day 2. Again, just type in revised GRE math, day 2, and you will find it. Okay? I'll see you tomorrow. Bye now.